Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to RAM Overload and today I'm going to be showing you guys what in my opinion are the top 5 rain meter skins of 2022. So you, you guys probably seen other videos of rain meter skins um, in the past, but you know, these in my opinion are the cleanest and you know, somewhat minimalistic just because that's what I prefer. Um, and also just overall really nice and calming themes um, that I like. Um, you know, a lot of themes, there's a lot of garbage um, themes out there. So these will just kind of give you a quick five uh, minimalistic somewhat themes and relaxing themes in my opinion. So this is the first one is called Robic, right? Um, I'll leave the download links for everything down below so you guys can check it out. So you guys can see this is a clean look. Uh, this background is mine. So unfortunately, backgrounds do not come with rain meter, which um, I don't come with the rain meter skin which in my opinion i think is a really downside because the background it basically really helps the um theme itself it enhances the the theme the features and the colors and everything so you got to cho choose an appropriate background for each theme so this is the one i chose you guys can see over here um and then it has a, a bunch of widgets on the bottom nothing too crazy oops i actually moved that uh, nothing too crazy. You can see the time up here and the date, uh, Tuesday, um, March 1st, 2022. And you can, you guys can see that I have no icons on my desktop and that is because I have them hidden. So normally this is the icons I would have, but you know, I just like more of a clean, clean look. So I just, um, hide the icons. Uh, one downside thing about that is like you can't highlight anymore and you know just me I just kind of like to highlight nothing just to make sure everything is responsive uh, but you can't do that because I guess there's no point to do that but yeah um, just keep that in mind all right that's the first one moving on to the second one the second one's called Solino okay I downloaded this from DeviantArt as well um, I'll leave a link for this as well and you guys can see this is very minimalistic as well um, these colors are changeable same thing with the first one that I didn't mention so you, you can see these colors over here uh, it is by the same author so it's kind of similar to the previous one in that you know it has a date over here and it's very minimalistic as well uh, me personally I like this background that I chose with it this paper airplane and the airplane in the back is not part of the theme that's just my wallpaper so keep that in mind um, and then it comes with uh, a couple widgets you know the internet music uh, the music player on the bottom uh, pictures folder whatever you want email so yeah that's pretty much it uh, for this one second one really nice as well and simple uh, also so moving on to the third one here we have Idealo. This is what is the theme. This is what the theme is called. You guys can see this. Um, it's, it's more centered towards the middle of the screen, right? Uh, so you would want a wallpaper where most of the things are happening on either sides. You know, in my opinion, this wallpaper that I have fit the best because there's nothing on the left, and you guys can see this line coming on the left as well, which is part of the rain meter skin and not my wallpaper so it kind of fills up the left as well so the right is empty and this wallpaper kind of just perfectly fills that in um, as for the theme itself you guys can see um, similar to the previous one as well uh, by the same author you know I, I believe this author got has one of the best themes out there right um, so you guys can see Tuesday March uh, the time and then weather and stuff, uh, other information. So there are settings, obviously, that we that allow you to change the colors of this. Um, so when you install the theme, you will see it pop up right away. Other than that, you could go to Rain Meter and re-enable it um, to get the settings back and change it. So that is the third one. Let's move on to the fourth one. Here we have a theme called Muon Suite, or M-U-O-N, however you pronounce that, Suite. And you guys can see it's also a minimalistic theme. Uh, you have this panel on the right, the center widget, and then these icons or folders on the left, which you can, they're, they're just one thing, so you can't put them wherever you want. Um, it's just um, one bar, you could say, of different icons, right, or programs. Uh, one thing that I really liked about this, it has like the power buttons over here and the lock button, so you can just click that to, you know, do whatever you want over there. Um, last but not least, 
This is by far my favorite one. It's called the Om Omnimo uh, theme. And you guys can see that it is really nice. Um, this one does come with their wallpaper. So it's not like your typical theme where you just press it and it automatically installs. Um, you do just press it, but then another pop-up comes for settings for you to basically do some customization. You can choose whether you want a dark theme or light theme. This right here is the dark theme that I have. And then there's also other options whether you want to use their background as well, right? Uh, so it does come with their wallpaper, right? Um, obviously, if you don't like it, you can use your own. But, you know, in my opinion, this one works works quite well with this theme, okay? So uh, th those are the top five themes in my opinion. Let me know what your guys' thoughts are. If you have any other themes that you would like for me to try out and you know think that I should, I should use, then do let me know in the comments below. I'll leave a link to all these themes in the description below, so make sure to check it out. Um, you know, other than that, make sure to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe. You know, it definitely helps the channel out and the algorithm. And other than that, peace out.